All right, look, you got to hold the trophy when you do the interview. Okay. It's, it's, a, it's a Momo contradiction, all right? Oh, As crazy. the new champ, you got to keep it going. Now, look, man, the storyline coming into this was all about Nairo. Can he retain and do the three-peat? Okay, for I you. I didn't even know he won two. I thought he won one. <laughs> See, look at that. He, you weren't even worried about anybody but yourself. Obviously, <laughs> I know you, you were a little disappointed in your performance last week. Wanted to bounce back, and you did so in a very strong way. Won undefeated throughout this whole tournament. Tell me, Tweak, how'd you do it? Um, I don't know. Yeah, Gamo was rough, so I just, I just tried my best. I tried my best to be positive this tournament. You know, enjoy the event itself. Yeah. Like hang out with my friends, and like you know, I, I just didn't feel any like. Like, it was pretty stable throughout the whole tournament. Like, I, I didn't have any downs or anything, so it was nice. A lot of <laughs> us, me and D1 really believed the turning point for you was that set against the bus. That was insane. And I, I, I said lost it, like 10 years of my dude, life. Dude, I'm telling you, I said it on commentary. That is a, a candidate for set of the year as intense as it was. Yeah. When you were able to, you know, squeak by and, and defeat the bus there, did you have, like, in your mind, like, okay, I have a real opportunity to just win this tournament outright? Yeah, for sure. I mean, like, there's a lot that went into it. For the debut set, like game one, like I, that was like just like that was even closer than game five, yeah. and that like that kill I got game one, like really like, you know, gave me some more confidence going into the rest of the set. But then he he made a comeback the next game, I yeah. think. So it was just back and forth. So try my best to just stay calm, and I it just worked, I guess. No doubt about it, man. I mean, you definitely got the results you're looking for. Fast forward a little bit, you know, you, you take on Salem, you beat him pretty convincingly in winners uh, finals there. You got the three zero. Yeah. Go to grand finals, a lot closer. You see Salem, I mean, he's one of the best. Salem he's going uh, to be able to adapt at some point. Salem you know? was hanging out with his friend, which is the ledge. Yeah, <laughs> you know what? And that's true. And that's true. That and was like <laughs> actual Salem. Like yeah. winners finals, like kind of just disregard that. Like grand finals, like that's him. <laughs> at any point in that at match, uh, did you anticipate maybe, I don't know, switching characters or? I was pretty, like I was 99% sure I was going Bayo against Salem regardless of what happens because he's really good against yeah. Cloud. It, like me and him have been like a, we've gone back and forth for like like years now I guess in Cloud versus Bayo. So uh, I'd rather just stick it out with Bayo. Cool. Hey, I mean you stuck it out and you got the dub. Nothing but respect sir. Congratulations. So uh, where can, tell the people real quick, where can we find you next? Um, I'm going to Hyrule Saga. Okay. I'm not sure if there's anything like in between that. Um. But yeah, I'm not, I don't think I'm going to be at E3. I'm going to be at, I think, some ESA tournament that awesome. around the same time as Hyrule Saga. I'm just going to try to go as much to as many things as I can. I'm not sponsored anymore, but yeah. I, I, I can still like you know get to what I can. No doubt about it, man. Well, good job. Congratulations. Thanks hey, so thanks a lot, guys, for tuning in. Congratulations again. The Tweak, your MomoCon 2018 champion. We'll see you next year. Bye.